Hello and welcome back to Road Trivia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode is day number 137 of the 365 day trivia road trip. This is a year full of 21 question random knowledge trivia quizzes. All the quizzes have 20 questions up front and then a question 21 tiebreaker at the very end of the video if you need to stick around for that. Thank you for watching and good luck on today's quiz. Question number one. In the aria Swazi Mobile, he tells Jemmy to stay perfectly still. This Swiss folk hero is immortalized in a Rossini opera whose overture is often used as music for heroic horseback riding. What was the name of this archer who shoots an apple from his son's head? That overture is called the William Tell Overture. His name, William Tell. Question number two. She was once hung from the sky with anvils on her ankles for attempting to rebel against Zeus. This Greek deity, Hera, is sometimes shown holding this fruit. Persephone ate some seeds of what type of fruit, which condemned her to live part of each year in the underworld. We're looking for the specific type of fruit that Hera is seen holding and Persephone ate. The answer is the pomegranate. Question number three. This leader crushed the Scots in the Battle of Worcester, a victory which caused Charles II to flee to France. What was the name of this Lord Protector of England who participated in the English Civil War? This Lord Protector was Oliver Cromwell. Question number four. This novel was inspired by the adventures of Alexander Selkirk, a sailor. A former cannibal named Friday is converted to Christianity in what novel by the title Englishman, who narrates the 28 years he spends marooned on a deserted island. This title Englishman is Robinson Crusoe. Question number five. In a play by this man, Giles Corey is crushed to death and John Proctor is hanged during the Salem Witch Trials. In another play by him, Biff and Happy Loman propose the Florida idea to their father Willie, who dies in a car crash. Who was this playwright of The Crucible and Death of a Salesman? The answer is Arthur Miller. Question number six. In the opening of this book, one character laments, Christmas won't be Christmas without any presents, before she and her sisters decide to play Pilgrim's Progress. What is this work that focuses on the lives of Joe, Meg, Amy, and Beth March? This book is called Little Women. Question number seven. This battle was codenamed Operation Detachment. During this battle, Joe Rosenthal photographed a group of soldiers raising a US flag. What was the name of this battle over a Pacific island during which the USS Saratoga was sunk? That famous photo of the Marines raising the flag was from the Battle of Iwo Jima. Question number eight. Jebel Musa is on the southern side of this strait. The other is a large rock that shares this strait's name. A proposed tunnel connecting Spain and Morocco would travel under what strait that connects the Atlantic Ocean and the Mediterranean Sea?
The answer is the Strait of Gibraltar. Question number nine. A break-in was discovered at this location after Frank Wills noticed duct tape blocking a door's latch. What is the name of this hotel where five people attempted to wiretap the headquarters of the Democratic National Committee in 1972? It led to the resignation of Richard Nixon. That hotel was called Watergate. Question number 10. In this Guy de Musapon short story, Matilda works for years to pay for a replacement after she loses what title piece of jewelry, but finds out too late that Madame Forestier's jewelry had been fake. The title was The Diamond Necklace. Question number 11. Kaloum's law was developed to explain this form of electricity caused by an imbalance of charges across two materials. Lightning is caused by what type of electricity? It also occurs when a balloon is rubbed with wool. This specific type of electricity is static electricity. Question number 12. This flower names Mahayana's most important sutra, as well as a meditation position in Buddhism, whose eightfold path is represented by this flower's eight petals. What is the name of this sacred water flower, similar to a water lily? The flower we're looking for is the lotus. Question number 13. This 2014 song singer demands girls hit your hallelujah before issuing the challenge, don't believe me, just watch. What is the title of this Mark Ronson hit featuring Bruno Mars, which describes the title Groovy District? That song is called Uptown Funk. Question number 14. In the film, this character uses Linguini as a puppet to cook at the restaurant formerly headed by Auguste Gusteau. Patton Oswalt voiced what rodent, the protagonist of the 2007 Pixar film Ratatouille? The answer is Remy. Question number 15. This city was home to William Lloyd Garrison's The Liberator. An engraving depicting a revolutionary event in this city shows Crispus Attucks dying in a shooting. During another event, in which American city was Griffin's Wharf stormed by the Sons of Liberty? All of those events occur in what American city? The answer is Boston, Massachusetts. Question number 16. This country's Chemical Ali released mustard gas during the Al-Anfal campaign, and this same country was bombed during Operation Desert Storm, a move prompted by its invasion of Kuwait. What is this country, formerly led by Saddam Hussein? The answer is Iraq. Question number 17. Whistler painted the arrangement in gray and black to represent this close relative of his. 
Dorothea Lange photographed a migrant one of these women, and Mary Cassatt painted many of what type of people with their children. If you know one of these descriptions, you know them all. All of these people are mothers. Question number 18. This religion's holiest gurdwara, or temple, is the Gold Temple in Amritsar. This Indian religion was founded by Nanak and its holy text is the Adi Granth. What is the name of this religion whose members wear the five Ks? The religion we're looking for is Sikhism, or Sikhs. Question number 19. This man gave his Sinews of Peace speech in Missouri, during which he coined the term Iron Curtain to denote areas dominated by Soviet influence. In an address to Parliament, what man stated he had nothing else to give but blood, toil, tears, and sweat? This man's name is Winston Churchill. Question number 20. A 20-hour 20 ferry ride will take you from Devonport, in this country's southernmost state, through Port Phillip to this nation's capital city. What is the name of this southern hemisphere island country founded as a British penal colony? The answer is Australia. All right, that is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode of Road Trivia. Today was episode or day number 137. Tomorrow's day number 138. If you're just now finding the channel, there's more than 138 episodes that you can play. We're actually on episode number 1156. So the 137, that is just for this year that we're doing. We also have over a thousand other quizzes that you can go back and play uh, from the last few years. Some of those are specific categories. Some of those are random. Some of those are harder. There's a ton of trivia. If you just go to our YouTube channel and check out the uh, community page, subscribe if you're not already. Here's question 21 for today. The American TV mockumentary, The Office, ran for nine successful seasons. Its final episode aired on NBC on May 16th of what year? If you're watching this during the premiere, yesterday was the 10-year anniversary. It was May 16th of 2013 when The Office aired its last episode. One of my favorite TV shows of all time. Thank you guys for watching. Check back tomorrow and have a good day.